Summer for many kids is a time to take a break from the books, but two local experts say it's also the time when children lose some of what they've learned in the classroom. Channel 5's Santiago Caicedo with tips for parents that they can use to avoid learning loss. Come August, Jesus de la Rosa will be a freshman in high school. Do you think it's going to be maybe harder? Yeah, yeah, definitely harder. His parents don't have concrete plans to keep him active academically over the summer break. Uh, I guess reading books during the summer or doing certain materials. No, I know he doesn't do that. <laughs> uh, we understand we want to give our children that time to relax and rest after the grueling school year sometimes. However, it's very important to keep students active and engaged. Nicole Science with Region 1's College and Career Readiness Office believes it's important to keep up with summer learning so children don't experience learning loss. For parents with little ones at home, she recommends reading aloud to children. When it comes to teenagers, if students want to engage in industry, for example, a certain type of uh, career field, by becoming engaged and continuing their learning through the summer, they'll be more prepared. They can build up their workforce skills, their lifelong skills. Signs suggest connecting with public libraries. Many provide free online resources and access to books. Summer camps through local parks and recreation departments or local colleges can also help students avoid learning loss. One local high school teacher and McAllen teacher union leader says parents should keep it interesting for their kids. You need to learn exactly what you like. So if somebody likes sports, buy them books, buy them magazines that talk about sports. He adds turning a visit to the grocery store into a reading and math opportunity by reading labels and adding prices. We'll have links to help you fight the learning loss on our website and on our CARE TV News app after the newscast. Santiago Caicedo, Channel 5 News.